Welcome to Beginning CentOS Server Administration, a video course by Puck Publishing. Regardless of whether you intend to run a web server, file server, FTP or domain server or a multi-role solution, it is the purpose of this course to deliver a series of turnkey solutions that will show you how quickly you can build a fully capable and comprehensive server system using the CentOS operating system. The course represents more than just another introduction to yet another server-based operating system. It provides a step-by-step -step approach to making your CentOS 7 server work and is packed full of useful examples. If you are a new or experienced CentOS 7 user, there is something inside these videos for everyone and it will become your practical guide to getting things done and the starting point to all things CentOS. My name is Oliver Peltz and I am a long-time user of the Linux operating system. I am working as a software developer and system administrator, where I am primarily working with all kinds of CentOS servers. I love open source and I am always interested in computer science and latest technology. I am also the author of the highly rated CentOS 7 Linux Server Cookbook by Pact Publishing. It is a practical guide for building a server solution. And rather than being about CentOS itself, this book will show you how to get CentOS up and running using over 80 different recipes. This video course here is part one of a series of video courses related to the topic of the CentOS 7 operating system and can be seen as a companion for the book. We will present the complete book's content in action on the command line in the form of easy to follow videos. That being said, it can be very useful and is recommended but not required to have this book at hand when going through the examples of this video course to learn more or look up detailed information about a specific topic. This is the first video of section 1 which gives you an overview of the whole training course. What exactly is the CentOS 7 operating system and why are we using it? CentOS 7 is a community-based enterprise class operating system. It is available free of charge and as a fully compatible derivative of Red Hat Enterprise Linux, it represents the first choice operating system for organizations, companies, professionals and home users all over the world who intend to run a server. It's widely respected as a very stable, secure, powerful and flexible Linux distribution. Big companies use it to run their crucial services such as web servers, file servers, FTP or domain servers. Also it's good to know that the development of this OS is very strong and updates are well selected and properly tested. In section 1 Installing CentOS we start out easy by introducing you to the task of installing your server using several different approaches, then updating and enhancing the minimal installation with additional tools. This section is designed to get you started and provide a reference that shows you a number of ways to achieve the desired installation. In the second section we will be setting up a full-blown virtualization training lab for the course. Here we will give you detailed and step-by-step -step instructions on how to set up a complete set of virtual servers we call training lab and which we will need throughout all the examples shown in this and all the upcoming video courses in this series about the CentOS 7 operating system. Section 3 Configuring the system is designed to follow on from a successful installation to offer a helping hand and provide you with a number of videos that will enable you to achieve the desired starting server configuration. Beginning with showing you how you can change your language and time and date settings, you will not only learn how to configure your network settings but also how to resolve a fully qualified domain name and work with curl modules. Section 4 Managing packages with YAM serves to introduce you to working with software packages on CentOS 7. From upgrading the system to finding, installing, removing and enhancing your system with additional repositories as well as the RPM package manager. In section 5, managing the system, we will provide the building blocks that will enable you to champion your server and take control of your environment. It is here where you will kickstart your role as a server administrator by disseminating a wealth of information that will walk you through a variety of steps that are required to develop a fully considered and professional server solution. Finally, section 6, administering the file system, focus on working with your server's file system. From creating mocking devices to test drive concepts such as expert level formatting and partitioning commands, you will learn how to work with the logical volume manager, maintain your file system and work with disk quotas. For this video course to follow along, some basic Linux experience is assumed such as basic understanding of computer networks, Linux file permissions, how to work on the command line, 
how to use a text editor and manipulate or search in text files, or apply regular expressions. The course has been designed with the novice to intermediate Linux server in mind, who is intending to use CentOS as the basis of their next server. However, if you are new to the operating system as a whole, then don't worry, you can watch my other excellent course Fundamentals of Linux here at Pact where you will learn all the fundamentals you need to know before starting this course and then come back. Please note that throughout this video course we are working with the CentOS 7 operating system version 16.11. We have a lot to cover, so let's get started.